people portray me as someone who is light-skinned, someone who is not of African descent or someone who is not of Latin descent. And in another big chunk of truth in this big question is, if I, would, if I did not make the choice to add all the tattoos that I've had in my body, I would not, not have bear that cross and be crucified all these years. So I, could, I know, knowing my worth and knowing my value in the world, that um, I could hide, I can camouflage, and not be my true authentic self, not make my ancestors happy and content with my contribution to the world, um, and turn a blind eye. <laughs> and the reason why I walked in here, like I said, was because um, quitting porn, trying to rescue what your mental health status is currently, and trying to have a safer future that you can be excited and happy about, but taking all that pain and taking all of the trauma that, um, you know, that I haven't gone to therapists, and support groups and start putting that anger and those emotions into positive reinforcements in the world. Not violent, not aggressive, but start utilizing and filtering those emotions to contribute to a better quality of life to those around me. Just to remind people that no matter where you come from and no matter where your community is and where you are with your mental health, treat people with kindness. And I don't mean that because they deserve it, but it is because it's a personal reflection of yourself. And once you start reflecting your inner values and your inner respect and you give it to, to most people, it will, be, you know, it will be reflected back. And the more kindness you show to the world, the more kindness is gonna be reflected back into your life.